Harry McClary from Donaldson's Dairy by Linley Dodd Read by Grandpa Wo-Wo Out of the gate and off for a walk went Harry McClary from Donaldson's Dairy and Hercules Morse as big as a horse with Harry McClary from Donaldson's Dairy Bottomly pots covered in spots Hercules Morse as big as a horse and Harry McClary from Donaldson's Dairy Muffy McClay like a bundle of hay Bottomly pots covered in spots Hercules Morse as big as a horse and Harry McClary from Donaldson's Dairy Bits of Maloney all skinny and bony Muffy McClay like a bundle of hay Bottomly pots covered in spots Hercules Morse as big as a horse and Harry McClary from Donaldson's Dairy Schnitzel von Krumm with a very low tum Bits of Maloney all skinny and bony Muffy McClay like a bundle of hay Bottomly pots covered in spots Hercules Morse as big as a horse and Harry McClary from Donaldson's Dairy. With tails in the air, they trotted on down, past the shops and the park, to the far end of town. They sniffed at the smells and they snooped at each door, when suddenly out of the shadows they saw... Scarface Claw, the toughest Tom in town. <coughs> said Scarface Claw. Off with a yowl, a wail and a howl, a scatter of paws and a clatter of claws. Went Schnitzel von Crumb with a very low tum, bits of Maloney all skinny and bony. Muffin McClay like a bundle of hay, bottomly pots covered in spots. Hercules Moss as big as a horse. And Harry McClary from Donaldson's Dairy. Straight back home to bed. The End Dedicated to all my grandchildren.